Hi Collective, this is Tiffany and Tooltip One. Hey guys, hope everybody's doing good today. It's a beautiful day. I got a little spell. You know, we, our comic family members, it's, you know, they um, they feeling the wrath here. They feeling this backfire. They feeling this, um, how can I say, like time is up. Okay. I just recently had like a huge argument with my comic family members and somebody in my building called the cops on me and told the cops that I was crazy because I'm talking the truth about these people. But you see, when these people do all this kind of shit to me, I never called the cops. You know why? Because I knew God was going to handle them. So as soon as I started speaking the truth about what they've been doing to me, my neighbors, the community... Okay, now everybody want to say I'm crazy. I don't know what I'm talking about. Making fake reports on me. As soon as the cops came, they took one look at me and realized I wasn't damn crazy. And then one of the cops, it was like eight of them in here. And then one of the cops stepped in my room. Immediately his eyes blew up. He looked at me like I was an angel. Okay. That he was like, you know what to do? Then he started to tell me what to do to get myself situated in this situation. You see what it is? You've been healing, and you're triggering healing, and you're triggering the outcome for your whole situation. Okay? Make some noise. Talk your truth. Okay? Talk your truth, collective. Talk your truth. Say what it is. Don't be afraid. God got you. God got your back. Okay? Your ancestors is watching over you and making sure that you come through everything your karmic family put you through. Successfully. You're going to be victorious. All right? Don't be scared. They try to back us out. They try to, you know, back us in a corner, you know, and to be scared of them because they be showing so much scare tactics. They thought they because they called the cops. You know, everybody put fake reports out on me already. You know, so the cops was going to come in and immediately arrest me because they're going to say I'm crazy. All right? They send in an ambulance. The ambulance people came upstairs. You know, they take your vitals and ask these stupid-ass questions like, what's today? And shit like that. <laughs> and I'm like, I ain't crazy at all. But immediately, they peeped. They peeped the scene. Okay? The cop started looking at me. He, I, I knew why he was looking at me. All right, you can see my crown on my head. You can see my ain't. You can see my wings on my back. Yes, you can. Immediately, they started backing off. Nobody said nothing. They just let me talk. These comic family members is going to hell for what they have done to you, collective. And it's time for them to get out of your energy so you can keep moving and move on in, in, in peace. You deserve it. Okay, so let me see what's in this channel in right here, collective. Because I just, you know, MK Ultra. <laughs> you the star, like I said, you the star. You got a comic brother that's around you that was doing some dumb shit. Your comic brother don't want you to be the star of the family. You the star seed of the family, collective. Yeah, I told you they can't run. They can't run. Right now, people want to flee the scene. People want to flee the scene right now. Your comic family want to flee the scene. Yeah, these people was really unloving to you, collective. Okay, homeless reverse. Okay, people love your energy. Came up reverse. They hate the way people love your energy. All right, be, they, they, you are fully aware of your capabilities. Your comic brother and your comic father and your comic mother, whoever is in your life was trying to hold you back and, and try to MK ultra, your, MK ultra you, okay? They they were afraid for you to waken up to your, your your capabilities. They was afraid for you to wake up to your abilities. Okay? Chosen ones. They did not want you to wake up and see who you truly are. Because you know what it is? You're way, power, you're way more powerful in your karmic family. Way more powerful. That's why it took a lot of them to come against you. They even tried to have you in a program, MK Ultra. This, I'm giving, this, this is giving me from when you was a young child. Okay, it shouldn't work. It didn't work. You can't be clones. You can't be clones. 
Yeah, your comic brother. Okay, try to have you homeless. This person, your comic brother, going to be homeless now. Yes, your comic brother is going to be homeless. Your comic brother going to go on a run. Cause your comic brother had you in this MK Ultra program. Along some of other family members, we already know that. Is there family members who try to put you in this program from when she was a child? They trying to run. I'm telling you, time is up. They didn't want you to wake up to who you truly was. And you woke up. They couldn't stop you. No MK, no MK Ultra, no nothing. Couldn't stop you from waking up to who you truly is, collective. Yes, people love your energy. Came up reverse. Your comic brother hate the way people love your energy. This comic brother is jealous of you. Because you're the star seed of the family. Mm hmm. Somebody dying out of the situation. Your comic brother. Hmm. Your comic brother. Thank you, spirit. Death. Wow, y'all. Yes, what I'm telling y'all. This comic brother was planning on your death and failed. Now, your comic brother got blood on their hands, baby. What goes around comes around. This person put death on you. This person is going to die. You can't do nothing about this. That's why I want all of you to detach from your comic family members. Because their time is up here. Mm hmm I'm telling you. Y'all hear them sirens? I'm telling y'all the truth. I am telling y'all the truth. These, your comic brother was putting false reports out on you to the community, to the cops, to, I'm hearing facilities, to places that you have worked, to try to make your life really uncomfortable. Because this comic brother realized that they couldn't clone you in this MK Ultra program. Okay? Even if they did when you was younger. Even if they were siphoning your energy from when you was younger. You was destined to awaken. It was no stopping that. You was destined to wake up and find out who you truly was. And really find out what kind of capabilities and powers that you have. They didn't want this for you. So they tried to kill you before you could awaken your comic brother. This person tried to clone you. It didn't work. Mm-hmm. Wow. So since the, since, the MK, since the MK Ultra program didn't work on you, Collective, this person tried to kill you. That's why this person is dying. That's why your comic brother is dying. This person, this comic brother, is, this comic brother of yours is jealous because you're the star seed. This sad, but it's true. This sad, but it's very true. We got these comic siblings that try to kill us off before we could even wake into who we truly are. Thank you, spirit. A bald head man is involved. Yeah, you're being praised by you being praised right now because you defeated this comic brother. Yeah, and keep your business to yourself. Anything you got going on right now, collective, try to get yourself out of the situation that you're in, keep it to yourself. Don't talk to nobody, especially no comic-ass brother and comic-ass family members. Because they all came against you. They been coming against you since you was a child. Because they all knew you was a star seed. Mm-hmm. They've been playing on you too. They're guilty. They're guilty. I'm telling you. This, this comic brother is guilty for trying to MK Ultra, try to clone you, try to have you in a, try to have you in a program since you was a child. It's all catching up to this comic brother now. This comic brother know they're going to die because they put death spirituals on you. They put death spells on you. They try to clone you. This comic brother know they're dying. It's going to be a death in your family. I'm sorry to tell you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. This is what it is, collective. It's too much for these siblings to try to kill us off. This comic brother is a drug dealer. This person sells drugs. This person is not righteous at all. Righteous at all. This person went down the wrong path. You want the right path? You want you want to follow God? Your comic brother wants to go follow the devil. And then since this comic brother couldn't defeat you by working with the devil, this person tried to set you up to get killed. Set you up to have you in MK, MK, oh, MK Ultra. Cloned. Mm -hmm. Your comic brother have a bald head and your comic brother is a drug dealer. Mm-hmm. Yeah. They all losing. I'm telling you. These comics need to go to hell. What I said. They're going to hell. That's it. These comics is going to hell. It's time is up for these people. This is our time, collective. This is our time. We've been through enough with these comics. Trying to kill us, rob us for our gifts. 
Okay, energy harvest us. You didn't deserve none of this. You did not deserve any of this to happen to you. Just because you're a chosen one, just because you're a star seed, you, you, you deserve to get tortured by your family, by your karmic family, trying to hinder you in life, trying to stop your progress. Don't want to see you succeed because they jealous of you. Because they don't have the gifts that you got. They need to take that up with God. God gave everybody a path. You want to go to right or you want to go to, you want to go to right or left? Which way you want to go? This comic brother ain't have the upright. This this comic brother didn't have a a, a, a a good upbringing. That's what I'm hearing. This comic brother is a narcissist. If this comic brother think that y'all family enabled this person to be this way. Okay? And went along with them because the whole family fucking toxic. Okay? So it looked okay. It was okay for this comic brother to do this to you. Because the whole family just alike. They all comic. They all knocks. They don't know no better. Yeah, they know better now. Hmm. When people start dropping dead, they'll see. Yeah. This came out again. You have a secret admirer. Okay. A hidden court case that you didn't know about. You got this secret of Maya right here. That's one of the energy. I've been feeling that for a little while too, collective. Since you know you've been healing yourself and you know you, you, you want your righteous path. That's what I'm hearing. You're your North Node. So, you know, you're getting your dude. You're getting your girl. They're your energy. They're watching you. <laughs> they watching you, collective. they watching you. Yeah, it's time for you to be happy in this lifetime. Yeah, God wants good things for you. You deserve it. You didn't do anything wrong. But live. Mm-hmm. That's all you're doing is living. And trying to stay healthy and alive. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So you got your new man or your new girl coming in. Your comic, your comic family members are trying their best to stop this now. Okay? Because once you get into a high-level commitment with your, with, your, with your new dude or your new girl or whatever, that's it. Y'all a power couple. Y'all raise up this whole vibration with just y'all love alone. You already met. I'm here with this. I'm, I'm here with past life lover. I'm here with past life lover collective. Okay? This person knows you already. This person has seen you before. God is sending this person dreams about you. That's what I'm hearing. Of your past life together. That's beautiful. Oh, that is so beautiful. Thank you, Spirit, for being here. Oh, that's beautiful. So, just relax, y'all. Be patient. Everything is coming from to for fruition for you everything is coming to light and fruition for you don't worry about the death in your family that's going to occur because i'm telling you it's happening okay wow what is that i'm telling y'all the truth <laughs> all these synchronicities okay i'm telling y'all the truth yes you have to you have to learn how to detach from this comic family because these are not your family Okay, they are not your real family, honestly. You know that. These are these are comics. You are not like them. You have to detach from these people. Because anyhow, you have to go to a funeral, go ahead. You know, pay your respects, whatever the case may be. But, you know, me, I ain't going to nobody's funeral. Nah, I ain't going to nobody's funeral. I don't know this comic brother. You know, I don't know these comic family members. I don't. And obviously, they didn't know you. Okay? Yeah, no, they knew you. They were trying to stop you. Something happened on Monday. Yeah. Your ancestors love you. They didn't want you to, um, they didn't want your ancestors. This comic brother, that's why I keep hearing it. This comic brother didn't want you to, um, the ancestors to bless you with with their gifts and protect you. They were doing spell work to, 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 have to ask your ancestors not to protect you, like to go against you. They that jealous of you. They was going into the ether. They was going to the ethers to talk to your ancestors to come against you, the chosen one. This comic bob this comic brother is demonic. Okay, collective? I'm telling y'all. Don't go to this person's funeral. You are royal bloodline. You are royal bloodline. And that's what this comic brother hates. This comic brother, I'm feeling is a stepbrother, half brother. You and this person are the same blood. You are royal bloodline. That's what they was coming after you for. Your blood. Your blood is royal. Your energy. 
Okay, they can live off your energy. This karmic brother wanted to live off of your energy. Okay, they want to swipe you out through this MK Ultra. Okay, because the comic brother is half half brother, I'm half brother, or step brother. But you and this comic brother don't got the same DNA, don't got the same bloodline. You're royal blood. Mm hmm. Yeah, your comic brother. Now, now, <laughs> your comic brother. Now I'm wanting to go and get a um, bullshit lawyer because they're going to jail too. Because they were doing some fraudulent shit to you as well. I'm telling you, hitting court case, what I told you. Hitting court cases here. This comic brother was doing some fraudulent shit behind your back. Yes. And they got they went and got a bullshit ass lawyer. They both going to jail. I'm telling you. There's a hitting court case. They had a court case already. Let's see. Why they had this court case? <laughs> For stealing. For stealing some shit. Your past on loved ones want revenge. I'm telling y'all. Your past on love, your past, your past on loved ones want revenge. Day death. So your comic brother probably killed one of your past on loved ones. Your comic brother killed one of your past on loved ones, like your grandmother, your mother, your grandfather, for money. Wow, did I just hear that? Did I just hear that? Oof. Your past on loved ones want your past on loved ones revenge day death. This is telling me that your comic brother, your half brother, killed somebody significant to you in your life. Your mother, your father, your grandfather, somebody in the family for money. This is your half brother. This is your half brother. That's what I'm hearing. Cause y'all don't got the same bloodline. So they killed somebody for money. That's what I'm hearing. For inheritance. That's exactly what I'm hearing. To get that inheritance. Probably your inheritance. Because y'all your half sister and brother. And your your passed on loved ones left you some money. Your comic brother killed your past on loved ones for this money. Your comic brother is going to jail for this death. They have other people working in on this. Your comic brother killed your grandmother through spell work. If your past on grandmother, if your grandmother passed on, and you have a comic brother, a half brother. That's not, that's not his grandmother. That's what I'm hearing. Or it could be. Ooh, thank you, spirit. Your comic brother is narcissistic. Your comic brother is a murderer. Your comic brother killed your past on loved one. They they are revenging their death now. They coming for this comic brother. Your past on loved one is coming for this comic brother. That's why we see comic brother dying and we see death. Because they coming to revenge they death. Your comic brother tried to kill you too. I don't believe I'm hearing this. I don't believe I'm seeing this. I can't believe this. Okay, what else we got collected? That's why your comic brother trying to get a, a, a lawyer. It's a bullshit ass lawyer trying to get them out of some shit now. That bullshit, they going to jail. This comic brother going to die in jail. This comic brother guilty as shit. It's a hit, it was a hit and court case over your inheritance you didn't know about. Your comic brother forged your comic brother forged some shit off your inheritance. Your name took your name off your inheritance. There's something with your money that your past on loved ones left you. Your comic brother killed your past on loved ones. I'm hearing through spell work. 
for this for your inheritance. Because your grandmother, this was um, this is I'm telling y'all the truth. Y'all hear them sirens. Y'all hear them sirens. I'm telling y'all the whole truth. I'm getting chills. Your comic brother, half brother. Like I said, it's not the same um, boy blood as you. They killed your grandmother for her money, for your inheritance. Because your grandmother left you the inheritance. And this comic brother had your grandmother killed through spell work. You wonder why? I know some of y'all was wondering if your grandmother was, you know, sick or whatever, but was not that sick to be dying. It was spell work involved in this. Anybody who passed away in your family, you felt like they didn't die natural causes. They didn't die from a natural death. You felt it, collected, because you are chosen. You can sense this out. Your passed on loved ones is revenging their death because your comic brother killed them. That's why they dying. They coming to collect. They coming to collect. Oh, thank you, spirit. What else you got? Thank you. Wow. Yeah, this comic brother trying to win. <laughs> this comic brother was trying to win at all costs. You didn't even know your comic brother. You didn't know you was in competition with your comic brother. Your comic brother was hating on you since you was a child because you're the chosen one. This comic brother know that you get prophetic messages. Okay? This person and this comic brother did not want you to waken up to who you truly was because your blood is for you. You are the chosen one out of this family. Mm-hmm. Your, your comic brother is narcissistic. What else we got? Somebody sharing an STD? Your public comic brother probably sharing an STD to this woman. And to whoever else they doing it with. <laughs> okay, what else we got here? Thank you, spirit. Something about popcorn. I don't know. This keep coming out. This is probably lighten up the lighten up the mood. Somebody, somebody, y'all love popcorn. <laughs> I love popcorn. <laughs> I do. I like caramel popcorn. Okay. All right. Oh my god. But this is giving me like. Mm. Oh, this comic brother hate that you, the way you be praised. People praise you because you are Earth Angel. You don't ask for the attention. It comes with you. It comes with you. It don't matter. It's your energy. Your energy is so powerful. You're angelic. You are Earth Angel. You are star seed. You can't help the praise that you get from other people. People love your energy. It came up reverse. Your comic brother is jealous of that. Your comic brother is jealous of you, period. Thank you, spirit. Mm, comic friends was involved in this shit, too. Somebody going to lose their job. Your comic brother going to lose their job. Your comic friends is going to lose their job. Everybody, I'll tell you, everybody's losing shit right now. Until the time for them to get picked up. I'm telling you... Your spirit guides is going to make their life really miserable. The way they try to make your life miserable. You hear me? Okay. Hmm. What else we got here? Yeah, your, your comic. Your comic brother is feeling everything this comic brother wanted for you. The ancestors is making sure they revenge their death. So they coming at this comic brother heavy at this moment. Okay. All right? It's going to be a funeral. I'm telling you. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Spirit. Something will happen on Monday. Something went down yesterday. What's today? Wednesday? Something down went on. Something went on on Monday. This comic brother was doing something on Monday. That's what I'm hearing. Trying to plan some more shit. Or probably trying to hire this um, bullshit lawyer. Because they know they're about to go to jail. Yeah, I'm hearing they're going to die in jail, too. Yeah. Yeah, because they did so much to you. They did so much of their sibling. Comic brother, comic sister. Yeah, you could be a woman, you could be a man. Take it as it resonates. And they did a lot to this family, a lot to your family. Mm -hmm. A lot of death occurred in your family due to your comic brother. This person is a murderer. Evil ass murderer. This person is materialistic. This person only cares about themselves and money and scam. This person is a scam artist. This person is a scam artist. Okay? Your, your comic brother had your comic friends. Okay? Probably going, going to this court to, to personate you to steal your inheritance. 
the sign, like have one of your comic friends look like you, dye their hair like you, dress like you, walk, talk like you, train this comic friends to go in and impersonate you in court. Because they had a hidden court case about your money. Your comic, your comic brother had your friends stalk you, gang stalk you, watch over, watch you every move so they could impersonate you. Okay, it was a plot and plan to steal your money and then kill you. This comic brother. Mm hmm. Yeah, yeah. People getting picked up. What I said? What did I say? Huh? The ancestors. The, hmm, the the ancestors that's revenging their death right now is going to torture these people, these comic friends and this comic brother before they get picked up and then they're going to die. That's what I just heard. Mm-hmm. From, from trying to plot on your life. To try to kill you. Okay? To try to MKO to you. Try to energy harvest you. Energy harvest means death to me. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Your karmic brother is a drug dealer. This person do scan. This person sell drugs. This person is not on the up and up at all. This person just can't get right at all because this person is not. I'm hearing a chemical imbalance. Mental. Mental. This person is mental. This person is schizophrenic, I'm hearing. Yeah. This person hides this in public. This person hides away who they truly are in public. You will never know. This is a COVID knock. They put on a strong mask. But not with you, Collective. Not with you. You picked up everything this comic brother was doing to you and the family. This comic brother tainted your bloodline. They bloodline. Okay? They bloodline. You are royal you blood. Thank you, Spirit. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 111. I mean, 1122, <laughs> a completion. These people, this comic brother and these comic friends did not want this to be a completion. They want to continue until they finish the job. I'm here, unfinished business. Okay, this person, this comic brother and these comic friends was not stopping. Okay, they were not until they completed the job. That's what, excuse me, that's what caught them up. God seen it all. God seen it all. Okay, this person was trying to kill you through drugs, poisoning, energy harvesting, stole your inheritance, and then killed your grandmother. That's what I keep hearing. Killed your grandmother for your money and hers too. They divvy out the money between the family, and everybody kept up, you know, they did a little blood oath so nobody won't say nothing. They thought it was over with, huh? No, your past on loved ones is death. I'm hearing your grandmother is coming to prevent her death. Your brother going to die. Mm-hmm. They're going to jail first and die right in jail. I'm hearing a stroke. So your comic brother probably have a stroke before they die, before they um go to jail. Woo! I'm hearing a stroke. Because obviously this comic brother trying to any energy harvest you. So that person, this comic brother was doing spell work on you to try to give you a heart attack. Okay? Try to have you have an accident. Car accident, I'm hearing. Car accident. Mm. This comic brother sending people to poison you. This is what I'm hearing here. You had your comic friends to come in and poison you. Listen. Your ancestors are not playing around about you. You crazy. You thought this was ever going to happen to you. You may have went through all of this shit and came straight, came right through it. Because you're an earth angel. You ain't dying from no comic brother's hands. Mm-hmm. Your family's still sending in agents. Wow. They, they, they recruited new people. They just won't stop. They won't stop. I'm telling you, your comic family sending in new agents. As we speak now, to fucking come and gang stalk you and shit like that. Recruiting other people. Because the old people that they recruited is caught the fuck up. These comic friends, these comic friends, or oh, your ancestors got in their ass. Oh, forget about it. They going down. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they need to go in and heal and they better go repent. <laughs> That's what I'm hearing. They better go repent. Okay? Yeah. 
be dealing with some shit here. You hear me? Hmm. And they dealing with some shit. <laughs> Your ex is trying to come in and get you pregnant. <laughs> what is going on with this ex, dude? <laughs> with this ex, girl. Listen. This is in the energy. Your exes want to come back and try to get you pregnant and shit. They didn't know your worth then. They didn't know they didn't know your worth then. When they was in your when they was in your energy, when they was with you. Okay? Now that they see you glowing and shit, all right, they want to come back and try to get you pregnant. Trying to be a part of the team now, huh? No, get the fuck out of here. Don't go back to no damn exes. They was a part of the exes, part of your whole scheme too. These exes are, these exes are karmic. All right? Those are lessons. Yeah, you've been cleansing your energy. Thank you, spirit. Yeah. You're going to cleanse all that shit up, that ex-lovers and shit. Don't have no ex coming back in your life and try to get you pregnant. They just trying to trap, they trying to trap your ass. But your ex was involved with this shit too. Your ex was involved with your karmic brother and your ex-friends. Mm-hmm. Your ex-karmic friends. They all was involved in trying to kill you. Because they all know you a star seed. They all know you royal blood. Mm-hmm. Your comic brother put them on. That's why they came against you like that. Why you think you ain't got no friends? You know they was demonic any fucking way and clones. But why the fuck you think that you ain't got no friends? Right? Everybody turned against you. That was surrounded. Your family members and friends and ex-lovers too. It was your comic brother put in their fucking ear that you are like, oh, that you was a witch. I just heard that. So they could come against you. So they, everybody trying to get you out of the neighborhood. Because your comic brother done sold them lies on you. They've been lying on you, collective. That you was a witch. Only a family member could do that shit. And set that shit off. Now everybody started to come against you. Because they thought, oh, you was a witch. Get, oh, yeah. Just get her out. Just get him out. Witch warlock. You know. They all coming for you to try to burn your ass by the stake. <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> I'm done. Yes. That was the plan. I'm telling you, that was the damn plan. They were supposed to burn your ass up because they said you was a witch. You do, I mean, sorcery. What the fuck? <laughs> That's what your comic brother told them. You do witchcraft. The whole time, this motherfucker is the motherfucking warlock. The demonic one. Okay, the demon of the fucking family fucking up the family bloodline. <laughs> oh, hell no. Yes. Yes. I experienced this is my story right away. I experienced this whole shit. And I came through this shit like a motherfucking champ. You ain't taking me down. Fuck that. I woke up to the truth a long time ago. Mm-hmm. About my karmic family. You better wake up, collective, and see what it is. Don't let the masses fool you. These motherfuckers are demons. Okay, they will take your ass out. They plan to burn you like you was a witch. Because they, they fucking scared of you. Mm-hmm. Your karmic brother don't have your gifts. Y'all got a different bloodline. You got the ancestors' gifts. Your ancestors passed you on their gifts, and you already had these gifts from another past life. This is who you are. You angelic. You are earth angel. You Christ light. Higher conscious. Okay? They were trying to dim your light, baby. This karmic brother was trying to come for you. All right? And you didn't even know. I'm telling you, you didn't even know your karmic brother was behind the scenes sabotaging your whole life. Turning your family against you. Turning your mother, your father, who else in the family against you. Lying on you. But they couldn't really lie to your karmic family about you. Your comic family didn't like you any fucking way because you're chosen. So it was all right for it was you know it was okay for them to go against you as well, because you are not like them. So once they realized that once your comic brother went and lied to these people about you, immediately everybody came against you because they didn't like you anyway. You irritate them with your fucking energy. These are demons we dealing with. If you had a comic, I'm gonna say comic sister too because I just heard sister. So if your comic sister, your half comic sister, was behind the scenes telling everybody it was you a fucking witch and let's take you down, cause she's jealous of you, cause she half blood, you full on blood, royal blood. Yeah, 
Your karmic brother, I'm here and cloak your whole fucking family to come against you. Put spell work on them. They were low vibrational anyway. They was acceptable to the shit anyway. Yeah, they were. They was acceptable to the shit anyway. Because they was low vibrational anyway. So any spell work that this comic brother put on anybody in your family, it was going to work on them, not you. You high vibing. You keep your you, you keep your spirits up high, first off. Your vibration is high on fucking hundreds, on a fucking a thousand. That spell work comes to you and bounce right back off of you and right back onto these people. You see it before it come. You seen the meeting they had. You seen the comic... You seen the comic brother and the comic friends and this fucking ex-lover. You heard the conversation they was having about you. You're that powerful. I know I did. I heard the all, I hear all the conversations. You can't get nothing past me. My fucking spiritual gifts went higher. Okay, y'all did too. And y'all got enlightened even more to the bullshit. Because anytime these people do any type of rituals on you or any type of spell work on you, you get even higher. You get even, you get even closer to God. That's the thing they don't know. So they breaking themselves down. It's going to, this comic brother is dying. I heard stroke. Mm-hmm. Thank you, spirit. Your enemies are scared now. I bet they are because the gig is up. This comic brother, your comic friends, and this ex-lover who came against you. The gig is up. I'm telling you, these people getting picked up. They're going to be sick. God is torturing them now. Okay? God going to continue to torture them until they get picked the fuck up. People going to get sick. Whatever they wanted for you is going back onto them. Period. Ain't no more stopping you. Ain't no more coming in your energy and putting spell work on you. Trying to plot to have you killed. Calling the cops. When you turn up, and fucking getting these motherfucking asses and putting them in their place. They want to call the cops on you and tell them tell the cops. Fossey Ports, you crazy and shit like that. That shit never worked. The cops came in and I swear to God, the cops came in here and looked at me one time. And was like, handle your business. They know what it is. Your energy is powerful. Anybody comes in your energy can tell who you are. Mm-hmm. Thank you, spirit. What else we got? Your, you this came out again. You and your children are safe. No worries, baby. Good news is coming in for you. Good news is coming in for you. I'm telling you, these people, the comic brother, your comic friends, were doing step death spells on you. And they're gonna have to pay for this shit. They did death spells on your grandmother. That's what I keep hearing. Your comic brother did death spells on your grandmother and killed her. And stole her money. And stole the money that she left you. Your inheritance. Okay, and had your comic friends impersonate you, and they had a hit and court case on your inheritance. Mm hmm. These people are guilty. All right, your, your ex lover have a bald head. That's what I just heard. Take it as a resonate. Mm hmm. Yeah. Yeah, your ex lover jealous of you too. Your ex lover jealous of you too. That's why it was, it was okay for this person to come against you. Your comic brother propositioned their ex lover to come against you, and they went with it because they jealous of you. Mm-hmm. That's because they hate the way people praise you. People love your energy. You're angelic. You're a, help, you're a healer. You're a helper. That's what I'm hearing. I'm hearing um, hitting angels, helpers. Hitting helpers. Thank you, spirit. Yeah, you got hitting helpers all over you. All around you. All around you. Protecting you from this energy. From any energy. Any negatives. Any death spells. Okay, your ancestors not playing around. These, these your ancestors not nobody come and kill you with no death spells. No. They, they, they appointed you to revenge their death. And that's what you're doing. Okay? Hmm. These soulless people. This is judgment day. Yeah, it is. I'm telling you. Judgment day is here. Your family going to jail. Your family going straight to jail. Your family is going straight to jail. I told you, it's time for these people to get picked up. Okay? Don't tell me shit. They're going to jail. <laughs> okay? <laughs> you are free, your ancestors. What I said. What did I say? What did I say, collective? 
Your ancestors are avenging your death through you. You are freeing your ancestors. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. They all are stressed out. These people are stressed the fuck out. They going down. They getting locked the fuck up. Your comic brother's dying. This motherfucker gonna have a fucking stroke. I'm telling you. This is what the hell I heard. Stroke. Mm-hmm. Hmm. 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 The justice system is involved. I'm telling y'all, they being watched already. Soon as you fucking came out, soon as you fucking opened your mouth, it's triggered off the whole system. You are powerful, collective. It triggered the whole system. Soon as you started waking up and talking your truth, you speaking wild yous. Okay? I'm telling you. It triggered this whole shit up. Hmm. Karmic justice here for you, collective. And karmic justice here for your past on loved ones. Hmm. I'm going to tell I got to go. I can't. <laughs> I can't. I'm getting upset. Hmm. Thank God. Karmic justice is here for you. Your past on loved ones is revenging their death. Because your karmic brother was put death spells on them to die for your money. For their money. For your inheritance. And then try to kill you too. And have your comic ex and some comic friends. These people are all stressed out. They know what's to come for them. Your ancestors is not playing. <clears throat> Collective, I love y'all so much. I'm going to come out this energy and I'll be back on for another read, y'all. I love y'all so much. And take it easy, y'all. Just be easy. Okay? Because everything is coming in for you. I love y'all. Bye.